welcome to Goran Guitar. We have Glaive here. Must be the first time here in Goran Guitar. Uh, can't remember I covered anything from him. This song is called As If. So, cool song here. Um, pretty easy to handle as well. We have pretty easy chords there and a simple strumming pattern, but with a capo on the first frets. Otherwise, tough. So, Keep on first, and with that, we're gonna go over the different chords needed. So let's take a look at the D first. That is open D, second G, third B, and second E. We have G next, so that is third on E, second on A, open D, open G, third B, and third E. E minor. So that is open E, second A, second D, open G, open B, and open E. We have B minor next, so that is a bar chord. You place a bar here on the second fret. You bar all strings except for the last E here in the bass, so five strings. And then the rest will be fourth on D, fourth on G, and third on B. We have C. So that is third on A, second on D, open G, first B, and open E. And then the final chord will be the G B chord. So that is second on A, open D, open G, third B. And you can also incorporate the open E if you wish. So there you have the different chords. Now let's take a look at the strumming pattern. So grab the D since that is the first chord. So one string around will be four downs only. So one, two, three, four. Simple, that is one round. So let's take a look at the first verse. You're gonna play two string arounds on G, sorry, D first, and then you go to G for two string arounds. That combo, D2 and G2, you do that for four rounds like this. of that and then you continue with E minor for two rounds and then just one down on G so this four rounds and after four rounds you play E minor two and G one down plus a pause and that builds up for the course so and um, speaking about the chorus, uh, it starts with two strong rounds on D. Then you're gonna split on B minor and G together. They will be for two strong rounds, but it's not evenly split here because B minor is played for three downs and G for five downs. In total, that is eight, of course, and one strong round is four. So they split on two strong rounds together. A B minor just gets three downs, like I said, and G five downs. So that short little chord progression, D two full strong rounds, then B minor three downs, G five downs. You play that chunk for three rounds. So it goes like this. rounds the B minor three downs and G five downs one two three one two three four five so that's what's going on and that is the chorus then immediately that leads us to the post chorus part as if as if uh, yeah that's what they're saying as if I as if I that's the real lyric there so you're gonna play and continue the strumming pattern here for D Two strong rounds, then C, two strong rounds. Then you're gonna play the GB chord for six downs. Okay, so one and a half strumming plus a short pause. So one, two, three, four, five, six, pause. And then comes an instrumental part. So that is the post chorus part. To summarize, these two strong rounds, C, two strong rounds, and the GB six downs plus a pause. Uh, 
And then comes this instrumental part. You're gonna play the same as the verse there. D2, G2, play that for two rounds. Then comes the second verse. It's played the exact same way as the first one. The only th thing here is different uh, with the amount of times you're gonna play. We played four rounds of this D2, G2 in the first verse. This time you're gonna play it for five rounds. So one extra round, and that is the second verse. And so everything else is the same. It continues with E minor 2 and G1 down plus the pause. So nothing changes there in the second verse. The second chorus is playing the same way. And the same goes with the second post chorus. Nothing changes there. Then comes a bridge part. And I wonder if I'll ever get it right. That's where we are in the lyrics. And this bridge part is played in the same way as the first verse starts. So that means D2, G2 for four rounds and that is the bridge then it continues again with third chorus played in the same way as the other previous courses and the same goes with the third post chorus and then it actually ends with an outro part and that part is played like a fourth chorus played like a fourth chorus plus a post chorus number four as well so it just repeats there in the end with another chorus and a post chorus part. And that, my friends, ends it all. So that is Glaives as if. Nice punk rockish song, I guess, uh, to learn and play with simple chords pretty much. And that's it. So thank you for watching, guys, and play tune.